Today we're here to share tips with businesses for what they can do if they're impersonated in a phishing scam. Phishing is when fraudsters imitate a legitimate business in order to trick people into disclosing personal information or money. Businesses can be affected by phishing if they are impersonated by fraudsters and if their consumers are tricked into giving away personal information or money. Some of the risks to businesses if they're impersonated in a phishing scam are loss of goodwill from their customers, harm to the business's reputation, and potentially financial loss if their customers decide to take their business elsewhere as a result of the scam. If businesses are impersonated in a phishing scam, the first thing they need to do is notify their customers immediately, and they also need to notify law enforcement. If a business has a social media presence, they can consider notifying people that way about the phishing scam. They can also notify people by letter, and they need to tell customers to be on the lookout for emails or texts purporting to be from their business soliciting personal information. And the most important point is to remind customers that no legitimate business would solicit personal information through an email or a text. Businesses should notify the Internet Crime Complaint Center at ic3.gov. They should also notify the Federal Trade Commission at ftc.gov slash complaint. And finally, they can forward any phishing emails to the Anti-Phishing Working Group at reportphishing at apwg.org. If a business is customers gave personal information or money as a result of the phishing scam, the business should refer those people to identitytheft.gov, which is the federal government's one-stop resource for reporting and recovering from identity theft. Businesses can find more information about protecting themselves from phishing and safeguarding information at business.ftc.gov.